the engineering in this building is particularly essential. We came uh, with kind of four goals, four main goals that uh, engineering should, should uh, aim for. And the four goals is for the building to be robust, to be resilient, uh, to be adaptable and, and finally to be highly sustainable. When we say that the building needs to be robust, uh, it means that it, it needs to have an excellent performance in extreme events like uh, earthquakes or typhoons. To solve this, we are basing the design on a base isolation approach, where the building, in essence, is dissociated from the ground and the ground moves, but the, the building moves much less. And then, on top of that, we have a, an elastic superstructure. And with these two elements, we, we achieve a, a minimal drift, a minimal acceleration, and then we decrease the level of damage when compared to a, an ordinary building. In the building, we have uh, mainly four types of facades. The main type is the one forming the cube. We can see here a bas relief uh, that shows the, the nature of this facade. The wooden columns are integrated in the facade, and that is a big advantage. Apart from constituting an important element of the appearance of the building, they also bring up the opacity of the building to a ratio which is uh, very good in terms of energy performance. We are at 60% transparent, 40% opaque. So the wood columns are very good help to prevent overheating during summer and to prevent uh, excessive heat loss during winter. We have uh, Venetian blinds in order to be able to uh, deploy them and, and minimize the radiation when the sun is uh, facing that facade. And then closing off that uh, cladding, we have an external skin. And that external skin is bringing lots of benefits to the building. It's both visual and technical. In the areas uh, where the sun is, is directly heating, the building becomes more transparent. We can see the columns coming off the ground and going up. And then when the sun is not so much directly heating, then suddenly we start having these reflections of the sky. So the skin of the building will be expressing the time going by and, and the differences in lighting conditions during the day.